Yeah. So for the PMP, uh, what could be the first activity? Uh, identify the trainer. Uh, okay. So here. Identify trainer, okay. So you identify the trainer here and then uh, after that, uh, what is the, what, what will be the next activity? Attend training. Yeah, so we have to say attend training and once that is done, what could be the next one? So after attend training, uh, self-study uh, or uh, apply for PMI, PMI membership, PM become a PMI member, that's fine and the next would be apply for PMP exam. Apply for PMP exam. And the next would be, uh, so here what can happen is, okay, once you apply, uh, so, that sometimes PMI will take the processing time, application processing by PMI. Then uh, what will be the next one? Uh, once your application uh, is approved, they'll send you a reference code. And using the reference code, you can schedule your exam at the nearest parametric testing center. Yeah, and once the once the exam is scheduled, uh, the next is what will be the next activity? No. Ah, study can start where? Ah, immediately after training you can start maybe, self-study. Right, so self-study can start here. Right? So self-study can start here. Uh, and uh, when should the self-study get over? Yeah. So here uh, I'll have to show it like now self-study should get over. I use a dotted line here. Okay, so here it is a dotted line and then here uh, what happens is, okay, now you write the exam. You write the exam here. So here, this one I call as a dummy activity because it doesn't, it doesn't consume any resources. A dummy activity doesn't consume any resources. So it is just to show the dependency that the writing exam can happen only after self-study. I use the dotted line. Okay, now identify trainer. Now let's say this takes identify trainer if it takes one day and uh, the training takes, let's say, five days. Or in your case, it is going to be more than that. So it is going to be, let's say, so now here we are talking about duration or effort here. So five weeks, two days per week, five weeks we are going to spend uh, so five weeks, so five weeks is 35 days maybe. So here we are talking about duration. In the work package, we have WBS, we are talking only the, about the effort. You know, when it comes to this 
activity on arrow and activity on node diagram, we are talking about durations. Now become a PMI member, let's say it will take one day. Apply for PMP, let's say it is going to take, let's say three days time, you are going to you know, complete your application from the start time. Application processing PMI may take 15 days. Scheduling the exam is just one day. And writing the exam may be just one day. Self-study, in your case, maybe let's say 35 hours of self-study. So in this case, this project will take how many days to complete? Uh, because this path is no, it is definitely more than that. So this path is how much? What is the duration of this path? Starting from here till here, how much is the duration? So it is 35 plus 1, 36 plus 1, 37 plus 3, 40, 40 plus 15, 55, 57. So this path is 57. Uh, whereas this path will be how much? 35 plus 1, 36, 70 plus 1, 71, 72. So this path will be 72. So this project will take how many days now to complete? This project will take 72 days to complete. The longest path in the network we call as the critical path. The activities and what is the uh, what is the sanctity of this on project management? So here, this path is the critical path. So how does it impact project management? Because activities on the critical path cannot be slipped. If they slip by one day, the project will slip. See from here to here, if you say what is the duration for this this path? Three plus one is four. 4 plus 15 is 19 plus 1, this is 20. Whereas here, what is the duration of this much? 35. So 35 minus 20 is 15. So these activities, these activities cumulatively, if I delay it by 15 days also, your project will not slip. Your project will get over in 72 days. Whereas if this activity slip, project will slip. Whereas these three activities, PMI membership, apply for PMP, application processing and schedule exam, even if cumulate collectively if they slip by 15 days, your project still it will not slip. It will get over on time. Is this clear? Don't even dream of uh, passing PMP without understanding this. Uh, and don't even dream of passing uh, a decent project management interview without knowing this. Because without knowing this, you cannot do any project management. Okay, so if it is clear, I'll proceed. If it is not clear, I think we should do something about it. Uh, it'll be in planning. It'll be in planning. Activity on arrow diagrams. Notations. Right. That's right. That's right. But then for me, uh, this is one area which you may not understand. Uh, if you, if you don't know it already, uh, unless somebody explains to you. Because these are some of the areas which cannot be studied by self. But go through it. It's, it's not something new. We might have come across these things in college. 
and we might have forgotten it or a period of time. Ah, okay. Right. The problem is without understanding this, you will not be able to use Microsoft Project as a project management tool. <laughs> you know? Because on the Microsoft Project, you will see a red line running through a set of activities. Oh, all those activities are on the critical path. See, now here, uh, Kohli, uh, uh, what I'm saying is, okay, now, uh, let's say, after this, our training session is over, let's say training is over, and the next day, let's say you are tired and you feel sleepy, right? So, uh, and you don't have the, you don't have the energy to do both self-study and uh, PMI membership, because these two things you're supposed to do on the same day. Now you don't have the energy to do self-study, one hour, and PMI membership. And you can do only one of it. Which one will you do? Uh, Self-study you must do because that is on the critical path. Because it doesn't have any buffer, any float. Yeah, because if you delay your self-study by one day, your end date will go for a toss. Whereas this PMI membership, even if I do after 15 days, no problem for you. So, so if there is a slippage here, if the slippage on the activities on the critical path, if I know this, I can always pull out resources from the non-critical path and then utilize them here. So this is the this is the this is the backbone of project management. Okay, so uh, so go through it. Uh, so uh, then uh, then okay we can we can yeah go ahead